hello guys uh, so in this video tutorial i would like to show you uh, how you can uh, upload uh, upload your lips and lisp uh, auto lisp so auto lisp is important uh, it is uh, sort of a, a program uh, for you to you know to do the, all the repetitive work so by uploading the auto lips file to the autocad so you can basically do the program automatically so in this case we want to highlight uh, or rather uh, show the northing easting and elevation the z value for each survey point that is being given out in this uh, autocad egl file so uh, first thing uh, you need to download the lips file as given in the topic uh, and then open up your AutoCAD, uh, the file of IDP. So once it open, uh, you click on the Manage tab, and then uh, Load Application, and a uh, pop-up window will appear. So in the pop-up window, you choose uh, the the file name. As in my case, is LLP. So select and click Load. A command will show that the lisp file is successfully loaded and then uh, to start running the program you need to type llp and then you need to click on the point of uh, survey the survey point that contains data of northing easting and elevation and you need to uh, build the lead line which is which act as a as a pointer so at the end of the leader line there will be a, a text three lines of text there is too small which need to be enlarged by selecting it and change the text height in the properties window so in this case i enlarge it into to 800 800 mm and repeat the process to the second point you need to type llp and then point to the select the node and then you need to build the leader line and at the end of the leader line there will be a, a text there will be three lines of text that you need to uh, enlarge so the same process is being done so in the uh, third example i will show you uh, how to use the match properties so that you can uh, enlarge the text size uh, in batches uh, so it will be easier for you rather than need to right click on every point and then selecting text height and then uh, increase the sizes but rather you just uh, in this example i do the program for three points so this is the first one Blue the little line and then uh, the second one and the third one so once uh, all the little line has been uh, produced all you need to do is select the, the, the source and then click on the match properties and click on the uh, destination of the property so you can do all three in the uh, a simpler step compared to the previous one so that's all for this video i hope you guys are able to do the uh, lisp thing and good luck with your work thank you